What came in the mail? Uh, sorry, background's gonna be pretty bad by the way because my dryer is going on. But uh, I had to film this because this just came in the mail. I unboxed it. Could have filmed that, I suppose. And I'll break the suspense now. What is this? Oh, it is a, a Brooks Brothers. Brooks Brothers 1818 Madison. But that's not what's special about it. What's really special about it. Oh, now, if you're not a reseller or you're not like into high fashion, you probably don't know what that is. And again, my, my camera sucks, so this is really blurry, but if you've seen this tag, you'll know what it is. Especially that right there. That is the Loro Piana tag. This is a 100% wool Loro Piana piece. I got it for 10 bucks on eBay. Uh, 10 bucks including shipping. It was three bucks plus seven postage. I picked this up because I was like, holy shit, this is a Loro Pianis by Brooks Brothers for 10 bucks. Yeah, I'll pick that up. Better than sub gouge price thrift stores, at least in Cali. This is first Loro Piana piece I've had, and really the camera does not do justice as to how like cool this tag looks. I don't know why, but like in person, and even if this was a good camera, like that tag just looks really cool. It looks really good, and I can tell. I was worried this was counterfeit because it looked weird on eBay. But now that I'm seeing it in person, no, this is this is legit. That's legit. 100% legit. Um, it's also a weird pattern. So it's got this window pane thing going on. You can see window pane is the sort of tic-tac-toe, like crosshatch, not the crosshatching, but like these blue lines. That's what the window pane is. It's also got something called Glen Plaid. Um, and it's got a hound's tooth pattern. See that right there? It's, okay, it's not gonna focus, but the, the pattern that looks like sort of jagged that is a hound's tooth pattern. And this has it, and it's also in a pattern, the sort of blocking where it changes rapidly, uh, where it sort of changes like that. That's referred to as Glen Plaid. This is probably worth, I could probably get a hundred bucks for it if I wanted to sit on it for half a year, but I'm gonna, s I'll list it for 55 or 60, I think, and get 45-ish profit, so and get probably 45 to maybe $50 of profit. So yeah, I am really happy with this piece. eBay arbitrage, not the greatest thing in the world. Um, and it's time consuming as all heck, but sometimes you get stuff like this and it is just amazing. I am really happy with this piece. And I will tell you whenever it sells. I'm gonna go list it now. Bye.